Now, I'm showing how to insert a table on a page in the SharePoint 2010 environment. First, go to the page where you will insert a table. In this example, I'm editing the home page of the online training team site. From the ribbon, select the Edit button to enter the page edit mode. Go to the Insert tab in the ribbon and then select to insert a table. Here, you need to specify the number of rows and columns for the table by hovering over the selection tool. Once you create a table, you will see a Table Tool tab showing up. In this tab, you have two options, Layout and Design. In the Layout tab, you can format the table, insert or delete rows and columns according to your needs. To change the width of a table, you can choose the width percentage in the Table Width box. To change the height of a table, you can choose the height in pixel in the table height box. Similarly, you can specify the width and height of individual columns and rows. In the Design tab, you can also apply the UBC styling to your table by clicking on the Style button, and then choose UBC Table Style. After you make all your changes to a table, you can click the Save and Close button in the ribbon to save the page.